Well, do you spoil your pet? For many of you, the answer is probably yes. Yes, and this morning, Alexis Davila is live at a spot with their own custom cat clothing and unique oh. services for your pet. I was wondering if tea would be covered. Yes. Here you go. What does he need? <laughs> <laughs> well, let's talk about it. It's a whole luxury experience when you come over here. And Juliana could kind of tell us a little bit more about that. When someone walks in here, tell me the process. Sure. So most people come to me and they say, I can't find anything that fits my dog. Well, I have the perfect solution. Bring your pup in. They can run around off leash if they want, jump on the furniture. And best of all, they sit right up here. And I can take their measurements. So this is actually Melfi. Who's staring at the trees over here? <laughs> Come here. Which is Stella and Chewy. Okay. And um, brought to you by. So then we take measurements, make sure we get the <laughs> right sizing down, because as you can see, she's a nice big buff woman. Um, and her dad wanted her to look more feminine, so I made this nice, colorful, I call it the pride collar, and a matching hoodie with a nice little pocket. And so all the fabrics are repurposed. So I source them from um, Scrap Be More, which is a local nonprofit, and I've actually repurposed over, excuse me, 500 pounds of fabric. This is some of them. So we then go and pick out the fabrics together, try on different samples, and your product's made to between two to six weeks, depending on what it is. Fantastic. And we have some other models here too. Yes. Let us know what they're wearing. Yes. So. <laughs> This is Sir Pepe Le Pew, my handsome boy. He's a hairless shiny, he's crusted. And this jacket here is actually one of the original prototypes that I made back in 2015. And it was a men's um, jacket. So this was actually one of the original pockets. Oh, look at that. So it was a Burberry influence. <laughs> so we have Joey here uh, modeling this nice little <laughs> outfit that I also found vintage. It's all about sustainability. And then we have Mr. Kirby here. So let's roll over. You said this one is named Kirby? This is Kirby, the Beagle Boy. Okay, Beagle. And how old is Kirby? He's seven. seven. This week. Oh, this week. Happy birthday. <laughs> we have some birthday gifts for dogs, too. And um, yeah. So that's kind of where we're at right now. Fantastic, yeah. fantastic. Oh, we had a whole trick going on here. <laughs> Just the best way to really show all the of lovely kids. Oh, there we go. Good job. Oh, my goodness. Well, thank you so much. Yeah. We actually have a few more models b back over there, and we're going to bring them back in about a half an hour so you can see more of the designs that she has over here at this shop. At What is it called again? Chateau de Marmotte. There you go. Cute. Some enthusiastic yes, models. It's the beagle rolling the over roll. for me. Yes. Yes. Very impressed. <laughs> 10 out of 10. <laughs>